OER Africa was officially launched in 2008 here in Nairobi um, at a meeting actually much smaller than this. And we have an old photograph where we all look very young and very slender and all of our hair is black. Um, but that was some time ago. Um, but I do think that by having focused uh, on establishing longer term relationships with just a few universities, it's enabling us to draw out lessons that are hopefully valuable to you all, but more importantly will be valuable to the, the higher education community at large. It suddenly dawns on you that we really have to think about curricula when we're thinking about the future. Think about curricula which are much more integrated, which are much more kind of designed around employment and so on, rather than uh, imagine that what you know, our traditional ways of training are going to be uh, suitable. To me, it's not wrong to start off with uh, asking a question about what is wrong, but to me, it's, that's the deficit approach, where I would rather take an innovative idea and see how I can experiment with that and how can I uh, transform practice and transform myself. That is where it should start. <laughs>